WUSA 9 Sports, sponsored by Xfinity. Friday morning, it was announced that Evgeny Kuznetsov, the Capitol Center and flamboyant goal scorer, was suspended four years by the International Ice Hockey Federation after he tested positive for cocaine back in May. Kuznetsov, like his countryman and Caps teammate Alex Ovechkin, is Russian. Playing on the national team is at least, if not more important to him than playing in the NHL. No representing Russia at the Worlds the next three years, and no representing Russia at the 2022 Beijing Winter Olympics. But unbelievably, he may not miss a game in the NHL. Players caught by drug tests can enter a voluntary treatment program if the league deems the player has a problem. But after a few days of embarrassing headlines, there's no other deterrent not to use the drug either during or after the NHL season. And it's not as if Kuznetsov didn't have a history regarding the drug. A video surfaced this past summer from a Capitals postgame party after they won the Stanley Cup, which features Kuznetsov in the foreground in two lines of what appears to be powdered white cocaine on a mirror. Here's hoping the player affectionately known as Kuzi, who's eagle flapping histrionics after big goals are part of the Capitals zeitgeist these days, gets the help he needs to realize he doesn't need cocaine for recreational or performance enhancing reasons. But the real hope is the National Hockey League will ban the drug like the World Anti-Doping Agency has in every Olympic sport. The real hope is that the NHL will not just look at the myriad athletes who snuffed out their own lives with cocaine the past four decades. Remember the phrase, Russian machine never breaks? It was named for a hilarious Ovechkin quip several years ago, playing along with every Ivan Drago stereotype about the indestructible monosyllabic Soviet cyborg, everyone laughed when the cap star said it. But here's the thing, cocaine just broke a Russian machine. It made Kuzi realize he needs help to stop using it. Now when is the NHL gonna realize cocaine can break it too? I'm Mike Wise.